Botswana came into this match looking for their first goal of the 2021 Kosafa tournament. In their opening match of the event on Tuesday, they suffered a slender 1 0 loss against South Africa. The Zebras had a chance in the opening stages of the encounter but failed to make it count. And just over the crossbar. The idea was brilliant and laid into the path of an oncoming player. And a great chance to open the scoring, but just put the ball over the crossbar. And just before the half hour mark, they pushed the numbers forward and took the lead. Chancey now, shot in! Oh, beautifully! A pile driver, no chance for the goalkeeper. He picked up his ball and saw the opening and unleashed a scream of note. But here comes Botswana. Just before the half time break, Botswana won a penalty. The penalty has been awarded. He had just gone around the goalkeeper and he went down. Tumisang Oribonye stepped up and completed his place. The, Makes it two -nil to Botswana. the 25 year old was not done as he made it 3 0 to Botswana midway through the second half. It was a serious hammering for the crocodiles as the zebras were firing on all cylinders. The final score, Botswana 4, Lesotho 0. In another match, Eswatini were up against Zambia. Eswatini came into this encounter having 1-3-1 against Lesotho in their opening match of the competition before losing 1-0 to Bafana Bafana on Thursday. Long ball played in, Mwene on the line! And Kenny Mwene does well. Backpedaling does a catch to the ball. If we can go over the line. Here's Moses Piri. Emaswati were looking to bounce back from that defeat by doing well against Zambia. However, the Zambians were also keen to bounce back from their 1-0 opening match loss to Lesotho on Thursday. Chipolo Polo were counting on the experience of the Premier Soccer League players, the likes of Kennedy Mwene and Augustine Mulenga, as well as coach Milutin Michos Radeovic. The Zambians, who had a number of goal scoring chances in the opening half, missed a seat up just before half time. Is this going to be deja vu? Because in a game against Lesotho, they had a similar chance like this one, but they put it wide and Lesotho went on and scored the goals. Eswatini were more enterprising in the early stages of the second half, and it came as no surprise to see them opening the scoring following a corner kick. Eswatini held on to their slim lead and won the match by the solitary goal. Mtutuzi njovu, SAPC News.